as the fire trucks, the floats, the kids, the bands, all assembled by Highland Park Town Hall. It makes me think of what Jimmy Stewart said when asked to define patriotism. Jimmy Stewart said, patriotism starts with the love of family and then it spreads to the love of neighbors and the town and then the state and then the love of country. And I'm thinking, what better place on 4th of July to celebrate love of family and neighbors and country than Highland Park? We're here on Highland Drive to watch the 4th of July parade across the street from the Richardson Robertson designed Mediterranean home that was completed at the end of the last century. The Rotary Club of the Park Cities has been sponsoring the parade the last several years and they do a great job. And the high wheel bicycle is off to a great start. Highland Park and University Park might have more Eagle Boy Scouts than any other place in Texas or maybe even the country. And here comes the parade marshal, Gerald Turner, the president of SMU. He came 15 years ago, and now this year celebrating the centennial. Hey, the mayor of Highland Park. Sessions, Rick and Dan Brandt. We just saw Congressman Pete Sessions and State Representative Dan Brandt, who's been so involved and chairs the Education Committee. Pete Sessions has turned into a national Republican leader. There's a reason that the school children at Armstrong are the best behaved and have the best manners and there's a program that will continue this performance through the next several years. Hi, I'm Elise McVeigh, and I am actually a manners teacher in the community, and this year I'm the PTA president, and with my friend who's coming up here, Tracy Bundy, we are starting a show for Highland Park um, K through H called Hip Connections. So we're really excited, and we'll be going out in the community and talking to kids and parents about why they love Highland Park and all the great things that we do in the area. And we do hope that they have very good manners while they're doing all of this. What reminds you of Texas more than U.S. Marshals on horseback? Highland Park High School. Very nice, Wagon. Has great academics and great sports teams. Many of them gone on to the major leagues pro teams but they start off on the Highland Park athletic fields. Nobody loves their sports teams more than Texans and particularly nobody loves their sports teams more than those in Highland Park and Highland Park residents. As SMU is celebrating their centennial and it's founded in 1911. It opened in 1915. SMU making great strides academically and coming back athletically. The SMU band is billed as the best dressed band in the land. For the 4th of July parade, they're going with that high on park look. Khaki and polo shirts. We like to know what you love about Highland Park. Highland Park is by far the best area you could live for a family. This Highland Park Parade, 4th of July Parade, is straight out of a Norman Rockwell book. It is Americana to a T. And as a matter of fact, we have all our family from Connecticut in just to experience what a true American 4th of July experience is all about. Nothing better than a traditional parade 
in this wonderful town of Highland Park, a parade by the people for the people. <laughs> You gotta love this country. As the floats finish going by, we'll go over and see if we can pick up the Bicycle Brigade and the rest of the festivities at Gore Park before everybody goes back and enjoys their block parties and swimming pool parties and they continue to enjoy their friends, family, and neighbors. Happy Fourth of July.